Hello viewers welcome back to another weekend episode Today I am back again with a very lazy day delicious and easy lunch idea How do you describe bun pot meal easy simple quick minimal preparation and obviously made in one pot If you are tired of cooking biryani all the time this dish is a huge time saver while on the other side it's packed with maximum flavors and i'm going to serve this rice dish with only gall pickle thanks a lot to my cousin shahida for sending this recipe for me the pickle was so delicious subscribe to nazima's taste of home press the bell icon for latest updates Please check the ingredients list in the description box. Now let's make the gall pickle. It is very easy. You can make in no time. I have taken 250 grams dates. Remove the seeds. Add the pitted dates to a small bowl, and then let's add half a cup of vinegar. Do not add more than that. This is exactly half a cup. Mix well and. keep it aside for about 15 minutes add 1 teaspoon of mustard seeds to a mortar and pestle and crush it just like this into a blender jar let's add the soaked dates and then add 1 teaspoon of ginger and garlic paste salt as needed 1 teaspoon red chili powder quarter teaspoon pepper powder Now blend it to a fine paste just like this and add it to a cooking pot. Add about 1 inch thick cinnamon and 2 cardamoms and the crushed mustard seeds, 1 tablespoon jaggery powder or crushed jaggery, handful of curry leaves and about 3 or 4 pieces of rampe. Give it a good mix. Now in medium heat, let's cook this in the stove top. When it start boiling, put off the heat and remove from the heat and leave it to cool completely now the pickle paste is ready you can save this for later use too so now let's add a handful of shredded carrots make sure the carrots are very thin just like this about a handful of slitered green chilies and about a cup of shallots make sure all the vegetables are pat dried without any moisture now mix it really well make sure to combine everything really well and add little salt or adjust the salt as needed give it a good mix and you can leave this for about 2 hours and then serve it with any other side dishes This is my cousin's recipe and it is very easy and I really liked it. And there may be other recipes for gall pickle so everybody has different recipes. Now keep this aside and let's see how to cook the quick and easy one pot chicken rice. I am going to marinate the chicken now. I have taken about 2 pounds of chicken drumsticks but you can use chicken with bones put some cuts if you are using chicken thighs or drumsticks add 1 teaspoon red chili flakes 1 tablespoon red chili powder 1/2 teaspoon turmeric powder 1 teaspoon cumin powder 1 teaspoon garam masala powder 1 tablespoon tandoori masala powder 1 teaspoon pepper powder salt as needed 1 tablespoon ginger and garlic paste one whole lime juice and give it a good mix and coat it really well and marinate it and keep it covered for about 1 hour or overnight is best i'm going to use this cast iron pan add about 75 grams of butter when the butter melts let's fry the marinated chicken cook it covered for 15 minutes on medium heat i'm going to take 3 cups of long grain basmati rice The idea is that by covering the skillet and cooking over a medium temperature you can capture steam and give the chicken time to cook all the way through. So that way you can make sure the chicken has cooked inside. Now after 15 minutes 
I'm going to remove the chicken into a plate. To the same skillet, add about two tablespoons of butter. Add whole garam masala. I have taken a piece of cinnamon, about four cardamoms, about three or four cloves. Add it to the butter and fry it for about 30 seconds. Add a large piece of rampe and one large onion finely sliced. Saute it for about one or two minutes and add two tablespoons of ginger and garlic paste. Saute further for a minute and then let's add one chicken stock cube and then let's add one large tomato finely chopped. Cook it further for one or two minutes. Now the tomatoes are sauteed well. Let's add enough water to cook the rice. Add salt as needed. Allow it to boil now. The ratio for basmati rice is for one cup of rice, one and a half cups of water. So add water accordingly. Cook on medium heat for about seven minutes. It's about 50% cooked. Now let's add the already fried chicken on the top and cook it covered for another seven or six minutes. I have put a piece of foil paper on the top for perfect cooking. And then after about 14 to 15 minutes, now this rice is ready for serving. This is a very easy and delicious, quick and easy, lightly spiced chicken rice is ready for serving. Believe me, this rice is so flavorful and very delicious and unusually taste because we are very tired of always cooking biryani every weekend and I am so happy I found this recipe and it is a time saver and very delicious. You don't need any special side dishes for this chicken rice. That was the reason why I made only gall pickle for this easy one pot meal. It was a very good combination. Hope you enjoyed this simple and easy one pot chicken rice recipe. If you like this recipe, please share it with your friends and families. Spread the joy of cooking. See you soon with another interesting recipe. Thanks for watching. See you later.